Hello and welcome to my first video on this channel. As an introduction, I have decided to do a collection video, so why not? Um, this channel currently does not have a name, but I will do a video and I will continue to do videos. So first off, let's get started. You might have saw a glimpse, but here we go. Getting started. We have Assassination Classroom Volume 1. I really like it. Getting more soon, definitely. Hold on, I need to probably zoom out. We have Beat the Vandal Buster Volume 1. I got this because it was a Shonen Jump, and I love Shonen Jump, and it was $4, so why not? Next, we have Bleach 3 through 9. This is one of my favorite series of all time. And I'm definitely getting more next time I go to the hall. Next up, we have D. Gray Man 1, 2, and 4. Um, I got these at a half price books. That's why I only have one, two, and four. Uh, I don't know if I should get more of this. I haven't actually read this yet, but I just heard it was good. Next up, we have Dragon Ball 10, 11, and 12. Uh, the reason I have these three is because I got these from a friend, and he only had 10, 11, and 12. Next up, we have Eye Shield 21, probably one of my rarest mangas in my collection, simply because, well, I found this at a Barnes & Noble the other day, which is probably one of the best finds I'll ever have. Really cool. Next up, we have Get Backers 1, 2, and 3. Um, I, I think this is a very underrated manga. Um, you guys should at least try it out. Um, it's easy to find um, at, like, half price books and stuff. I've noticed it at a lot of used bookstores, and it's relatively cheap online, if you want to get it online. Next up, we have Hunter x Hunter 1 and 2. Really okay series, in my opinion. I think it's a bit overrated, but it's still pretty good. Not I, and I mean, I like Yu Yu Hakusho better, but I still like it. And I got these both for a really good deal online i mean i got one of them in person but yeah next up we have hikaru no go another really underrated series that i really enjoy and i found these at a half price books for four dollars each that was a great deal next up we have inuasha 3 um personally i don't have really i have mixed opinions about inuasha i know a lot of people say it's really good but my one problem with this specific volume is that it's flipped so it's put, made like an english book instead of an actual like manga which i really dislike um, I wish it was not flipped, and I think, I don't know if, like, every Shonen Sunday manga is like this in English. I'm not sure, because this is the only one I have. I'll have to check it out when I get, like, Zatch, Zatch Bell or Case Closed. Next up, we have JoJo. I also got these from that same friend. These were $5 each. This is a great deal, and he only had these two, but it was still a really good deal. Next up, we have My Hero. I also got this from that friend four dollars um he doesn't like my hero anymore so i took it same with jojo and i just bought dragon ball because he's selling it but yeah next up we have um naruto one two and through seven um these are kind of faded i might get replacements for these and then we have the shonen jump pack for um spring 2020 probably the last one um because covid kind of ruined it i like naruto um i think it gets a lot of hate and i think it does deserve the hate i mean it's popular of course it's gonna get hate i really enjoyed it um i don't really enjoy i i enjoy the original more than shibuden besides like the pain invasion and the, the war arc other than that like there are some very boring parts of shibuden but um but this was a great series up until the end and i really really like naruto next up we have prince of tennis volume four i got this once again because it was a shonen jump manga I really, I read this um, without reading the first three volumes, and I still really enjoyed it and knew what was going on. So, it, it is a great story, and it's easy to follow along. Next up, we have, a, next up, we have Shaman King 1 through 5. This is a pretty rare series to come by now, because, like, pe everyone wants it because of the new anime. And there is going to be three ones, but I personally prefer the singles, and... I'm gonna tell you something that really sucked. Like, I saw the singles 1... Um, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, and I only picked up um, two, four, and five. I already had one and four, but I but they're in bad condition. They're these are only in okay condition, and I was gonna go back and get the rest of them because instead I got Get Backers and Naruto, which actually wasn't worth as much, and that is one of my biggest mistakes I've ever made. I don't think I can recover from that because those three volumes are like thirty dollars each, and I could have got them for four dollars each, and it sucks. It really sucks. So, I'm gonna have to, I learned my lesson, and now if I ever see Shaman King, I'm buying it. I don't care if I have a double. It's just worth it so much. It's just really worth it. And I recommend picking up the series if you find it. It's just a really good series, too, and it's pretty rare. Um, so, 
Or you can wait for the three ones, but I personally prefer the singles. Next up we have um, the last series on my shelf. Subasa Reservoir Chronicles. I have 1, 2, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. I will explain why I have 6 through 10. Um, so I went to a half price books with my friend, and they had two copies of 6 through 10. So we each got 6 to 10, and they also had two. I got two. And then I went to the other half price books in my town and got this, which was their Subasa Volume 1 on clearance for, get this, a dollar. Just a dollar. And it was, it's in perfect condition. Um... I love Sabatha Reservoir Chronicles. I'm currently on. I've currently read all of this right here. I've read um, the other volumes online, and I plan on getting more. Um, it does like slow down, like around here. It just starts to get kind of, you know, slow down. I feel like Clamp didn't really put their full effort into this series compared to something like XXX Holiday and Chobits, but it's still a really good story, and I think it's out of print. I'm not. Don't quote me on that, but I think the singles might be out of print. Um, but yeah, um, so yeah, that's my collection, and here's a view of it, and I will continue to expand it. This is um, after about six months of collecting, and I think this is pretty good for six months of collecting and being a kid with no money. <laughs> and I have, I've just used the money that I've made. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next video, which will probably be a vlog at Half Price Books. Thank you guys for watching.